Oh, okay, I realized that last video was another headless video. I think it may, I had the lens on the wrong side. Anyway, I've been working this dog a little bit on a stay, and you just, you know, I think the platform is good, and you've got to be careful, though, that you're not, yay. just use the word sit. I don't use stay and definitely I don't think, you know, again, I don't think you want the huge demarcation line. Sit. Okay. And I gotta be careful that he doesn't dance me around. Just because he's so loaded up, it's very easy to just get him. Easy. Now he's going to leap through the air. Again, I'm giving him every signal. This shoulder. Heel. But now I'm steering him with this hand. He started to turn without, and I brought this hand back into play real quick. This was the dog that in the beginning only turned this way. See, he's trying to, he's trying to turn me. Your plan when that happens is now don't turn that way anymore. Sit. If you can yay him there, what you don't want, because you see that, when the people start walking back, the dog mm, droops and drops its head. Oh, why wouldn't it? <laughs> Sit. My job is to have some ability to not uh, be controlled by that walking. Hello, Victoria. I think you do, though. beginning, I think you should have more sit. I think you should have more go than you need. What a cute dog, too. This is their posing training, Mike. This is, you better start on this stuff, too. It's called modeling training, where they learn to sit still and get their picture taken. Okay. <laughs> But if I can just marry sit, marry that sit with this other stuff. So there's my pager. Boom. Now the pager goes off when he gets back up there. It's it's confusing, but you're driving him back up there with the pager. So it's really not a correction, but sit. Let me tell you, he's like the type. He goes sideways too. He goes this way, but you better be a you better be a linebacker. him back up there. That's why he kind of looked to the side. Oh, he smells a treat under there. That's a wrap. That's my new, uh, that's my new thing that I'm saying, Mike. That's a wrap. You know, but I'm not... Oh, my socks match today. It's craziness. It's craziness.
and look at him. That's how he is. He'll just shove the climb out of the way to get the tree. So I've got more momentum than I can handle. You know, and if you said, well, what's that like? Well, it's like you don't drive your car at 135 or whatever the speedometer goes up to. So, but I just, I need to marry that together and I'm, I'm doing it and the platform is helping sit. And I can, the difference is when I'm picking him up, I'll sit, I'm on that side. Uh, when I'm making him stay, I'm on this side. But my exit and return is all very, there's my pager. And when he went back up there, as soon as his feet were back up there, I let the pager up, sit. I'm yaying him there. I'm yaying him there. So, oh, that's right. I'm giving him two. I'm giving him two sides. Now, when I go on this side, so that's that's Dr. Jekyll. This is Mr. Hyde. Heel. I mean, that's a wrap. That's a wrap. I like that one though, don't you? Because we're on film anyway. Oh yeah, oh no, he's he's all kinds of go. He's all kinds of go. So all right, so we can do the uh, you know, but I think that's what you want. If you've got a dog that you're and that's you know, I think that's what made me realize that that girl the other day. If it's not going faster, we can encourage it. If it's not going fast enough, encouragement isn't what it needs. It needs a different methodology. You know, because if you've got it to the point where you're trying to generate momentum in the dog you've already failed i think you know so you want more than you you know this dog is just a good dog for when people that think they know how to train a dog come you say oh here take this one out next thing he's got him on the ground took all the treats <coughs> yeah all right hang on sit so now i gotta marry my quiet sit with the Oh, that'd be a good one. You see how we can measure how far the climb slid. Oh, that'd be a good one to put in slow-mo, don't you think, Mike? The climb scooting out of the way. Ah! All right, hang on. Nachos. All right, let me see if I can... There's my pager. Sit. See if I can marry my sit back again. And honestly, when I'm saying sit at that point, if he stands upright, I don't say anything. I'm just kind of compartmentalizing the behavior, so. Dr. Jekyll. <laughs> Mr. Hyde! That's a perfect the platform, you, the two sides. Oh, that'll be, a, maybe that would catch on. My two-sided training, well, what's that? Make it all mysterious. Sit. So now I gotta, oh, you see him look at me. I gotta marry this together, sit. <laughs> Anyway, I think you can kind of see, uh, you know, where you would go with that. But again, I'm not looking to get him out here and start correcting anything. In my mind, if you get it out here and it's failing, you're doing something wrong. You know, I mean, if the kid is failing in school, you've got to figure out a different way to help him learn. You know. And honestly, if you can't have animated labs, I don't know what kind of animated dogs you would be able to have because, you know, if you see a lab that's not animated, that's not good. That's not good. All right, guys, I'll be right back with the little dog episode.